Hey guys. Well, it's uh, January 1st. And it was three years ago, I think, on January 1st, I started these videos. Um, you know, I, I don't know. I don't, I got several of you, the ones watching it will know to, that watch. But, you know, it's not like I get, uh, you know, 5, 10, 20,000 people watching a, a video like some some guys you, you see on YouTube, you know, and, and uh, I don't normally go off into a rant about something. Um, but there's something I've learned, I guess, through, uh, well, learned it probably some time ago, but I relearn it all the time. And you'll know what I'm talking about. Is that's how important relationships are. And, and I'll just let you look at these sheep and ghosts lying out there eating the hay I just enrolled. Uh, but, man, it seems like our whole business runs on some kind of relationships. Um, yesterday we went and looked at a, a pretty good sized ranch for our area that wants to uh, see if we'd bring sheep and goats over there and, and run on it uh, to control the brush and the weeds. And it's a guy that I met about eight years ago. Um, and he was interested in getting sheep and goats. And they, I helped him get some. And, and I sold him some and helped to get him some dogs. And, and just helped him along the way. When he didn't have a problem, he'd call. And uh, now they decided, you know, they like what they do. But they don't have enough or enough time or enough help to... Uh, you know, do the amount that they they need on that size of place, and and so we're looking at what it takes to go over there and, and do that. But opportunities like that only come about, whether they're good or bad. Uh, they only come about because of the relationships that you know. I just I, I met that guy and and helped him out along the way, never really thinking, you know, that he would. Uh, we would put goats over there just knowing that he was somebody that needed some some help with his own herd but it's just relationships like that and just people i know we've got goats on several people's property just because of a relationship somewhere along the line that that they uh had with me or with somebody that knew me um and now you know even the relationships with the people that the helper like Travis um, and now we, we just hired uh, a guy Luke which Travis has known growing up it's actually his cousin but it's through relationships and uh, everything the whole well the whole world runs on relationships and everything we do your whole business can't run without it really. I don't know of a business that can. So, uh, and, and I get people that call me and they, oh, uh, maybe it's it's hard because you work a job in town and you don't have relationships with the people down the road or in the community or, or something because you're, you're having to drive to work somewhere. And that makes it tough, you know, to rent ground, to find pasture, those kind of things. Because you don't have those relationships. And I wish I had a, a magic formula to tell you how to create those. But, but you know, uh, I mean, you know how to do it. And I'm not telling you anything you don't already know, but maybe you'll just relearn it here again. And reemphasize it into this, this new year is just... How important relationships are, not just for business, but even your personal relationships, your relationships with your family and uh, your wife, your, your children. Um, yeah, that's, that's what makes it all worth it. You can't, you can't survive. Well, I don't. Know, you can't. I don't think you can survive without relationships. Uh, maybe somebody does somewhere, but uh, so yeah. I guess if I had something to say, hey, what can I do to 
increase profit or grow my business or uh, you know make things work better whatever it is <laughs> maybe it's just relationships and finding that relationships along the way that you can help each other um, and you know it's just like anything you don't even know who that that person might be um, but I know I wouldn't be where I'm at today without relationships I have not just with my wife and family friends people in the community so there you have it guys when you increase your business you increase your, your personal satisfaction um, increase the depth and the breadth of your relationships And I have to say, I mean, one thing I didn't expect from these YouTube videos is uh, relationship, relationships from them. Um, I just figured it would be me talking about something, whatever we were doing, things. But you know what? You know, your comments, um, and when I answer your comments, I try to answer all of them. Sometimes it makes me think, and it makes me... Uh, you know, rethink why I'm doing something or what I'm doing when I have to explain it to somebody. So I appreciate that. I appreciate, hey, sometimes when I'm someplace, um, sometimes it aggravates my wife or somebody's with me, but they'll come up to me and say, hey, uh, you know, you Greg Christensen, yeah, I watch your videos, you know, and and you appreciate it. And, and hey, you know, that's, that's kind of icing on the cake, maybe, something I didn't expect. Um, and you know just the fact that somebody out there does appreciate this and and i i really uh thankful and grateful for your comments and some of you just say hey thanks for the video hey thanks for the video and and maybe i don't answer all of those but i'm very thankful for all of you that do that um you know i maybe I should do more things like hey subscribe hit the subscribe button hey give me a thumbs up or whatever that it's um, I don't know but you know I'm really thankful that uh, this is relevant to somebody out there um, and so yeah even these videos uh, sometimes they seem one-sided it's just me talking about something that we're doing or, or maybe Travis, but um, but no, they've grown our relationship even if I've never met you. Um, yeah, the, the people that, when I do meet them, they'll say, hey, I you know, watch your videos or something, and, and uh, I might already have a relationship with you because of the comments or, or things that uh, you, would, you would put on the, the comments there and I know who, who you are so hey thanks uh, thanks for watching thanks for commenting thanks for just uh, I don't know being an audience <laughs> um, didn't really know how that would work out but it's been three years and and I'll I don't put videos up regularly I only do it when maybe we're uh, doing something I think that somebody else could learn from I don't just do it every day just to say I got one up today or this week or whatever and but uh, uh, sometimes I put up one every day for a couple days but then sometimes we're not doing nothing for a few weeks it's I think is, is uh, worth you guys time and an effort to tune in and watch so but uh, sometimes I I should probably be more uh, aware that that you need uh, there, there's things out there that I do I probably just take for granted because it's just what we do and, and when, but when I was starting out like maybe some of you are or didn't even have any sheep or goats but was looking into it um, you know that's not that common so hey I'll try to do a better job of that so yeah, so, yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the relationship, guys. I appreciate it.